So today we're going to take some of the trout that we caught the other day and make them into puppy treats. I'm not a big trout guy, and uh, but I know that she is. So we're going to do a little dehydrating, a little smoking, and see what turns out best. I just cleaned all this fillets off. Um, it was three days, three limits worth of trout. And as I was coming home with them, I would put them in the freezer and just throw the fillets in there. And so there was some, you know, some dirt, some scales, all that kind of stuff. And I wanted to pull them all out, get them thawed off. And then what, as I was going through them, I noticed not all the fillet jobs were the best. So I'm just going to trim up some of this meat to make it. So we don't have any bones. We don't have any, um, there'll be some pin bows in here on these fillets. Uh, with trout, one thing you'll find is that down the middle, there's a row of pin bones. You can feel them if you run your finger down them and you just can't, there's nothing you can do about those. They will, when we dehydrate and when we smoke these, they should soften up to the point where it's not an issue for the pup. I know that I've, I've done this with um, salmon before. And if it's big salmon, I will, I will use a pair of pliers and get those, those pin bones out. But for this, I mean, they're small bones um, and they should just soften up to the point where the dog there's no chance of choking on those but you just want to always be mindful and check when you're done smoking or dehydrating these treats that those bones are soft you know that they're you can see and here's here's what i'm talking about like these little little tiny bones they're just not super thick i mean you'd really it'd take a lot of work to get them out of there and they will just cook down and soften what i've opted to do here for our first round in the dehydrator is I'm going to cut these pieces into smaller chunks. It will hopefully dehydrate out pretty well. However, this first little piece batch here, I'm going to do with the skin on. I might skin some later so that we can have an experiment with skin on and scale, skin off. We've got a lot of trout here, so we can try multiple different methods. All right, got the trout cut up that we're gonna dehydrate. So we're going to blow the lid on, get the plug in, and we're going to, uh, fish. I don't know if you can see that on here, but oh, fish and jerky, 160 degrees. So we're going to plug this bad white hand. Make sure we're at American 60. Let it go. Mm -hmm. 